G'day guys, welcome to G-Man Speaks. Today we're going to take a look at the Button Australia. And this is a show, it's like a dating show where they basically, they sit there, talk, and then they, they have to press a button once the red light comes on, um, if they're not vibing the other person. So I think this show's funny to watch, I think it's absolute trash. <laughs> it shows you um, the state of the dating market and young people uh, in general and how they treat interactions and general respect with each other. Um, so that's why I cover this one um, every now and again when they release an Australian one. Now, these were released like, you know, the better part of a year ago, but I'm just sort of coming across a lot of these. So without further ado, let's jump in, have a laugh at them, and yeah, grab a drink and enjoy it, fellas. Yeah, but um, I only started a couple years ago, and I love it. Like, it's right. so fun. Like, I can do, like, flips and stuff. Can you? Yeah, do you want to well, see? Sort of <laughs> no, 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 I'm not, not, not going to do that now. That's it. Um, <laughs> but yeah, okay, I feel like we've got kind of, like, similar backgrounds then. Yeah, we do. Oh. So and is acting like your full work, or do you do something else? No, I do IT. You do IT? Yeah. You fix computers and stuff? I fix computers. Hey, little young Jamie Foxx here, man. He'll have a BBC, but I reckon he's not as nice and calm as he's coming across. What I've noticed is a lot of these women um, who come on this particular show, they say they're singers, they're act act actors, actresses, whatever you want to call them. Um, but really, I think they're on this show to try and maybe get a break. I think they treat it a lot like... I don't know if you guys remember, like, back in the early days, 20 years ago, I remember I went to one of these. It was a Big Brother casting. So Big Brother, that show, you know, where you go on and the whole world watches you live with hidden cameras everywhere. It attracts a certain kind of person. At that point, I thought, I'm going to give it a go. So I went down there. It was a Sydney My Music Bowl in Melbourne, which is a big stadium. There was, like, 50,000 people there. And then they started asking everyone to try and obviously um, find people who would be entertaining to do all these sort of um, exercises in terms of, you know, uh, uh, crawl on the floor and act like a pig and stuff like that. And I started doing that. I just walked out and said, you know, not, not going to denigrate myself. But you should have seen all everyone, especially the women jumping around and they were like little pigs oinking and squealing and shit like that, trying to get some attention, trying to get on TV. That's what I think this show is. So you have a lot of these women saying they're actors and... Um, they're, they're, they're dancing and they're singers. Maybe they like the idea of it, but I, I, I would doubt a lot of them have any credentials behind them. Sorry, I don't know much about IT. Well, yeah. you'll get to know a lot more if you... Oh, uh, yeah. Do you want to get I to like know me I like your smile, more? by the way. You get to know uh, more. I said I like your smile. My smile, thank yeah. you. I had braces for four years. Oh, did you? So, yeah. it was a journey to get here, but I appreciate it. I mean, they do look perfect. So that's, thank you. Yeah. You've got a nice smile as well, actually. Uh -huh. Are they real? Your teeth? They are real. Sorry. Too nice, mate. She wants to be choked out. She wants to be put in the, in the Lex League of Torture Act. Just, you know, thrown on the bed, choked out. Like, you can tell the look on that one. Probably an OnlyCans model. Sorry. <laughs> You're really nice. It was nice to meet you. Oh. You're really nice. Yeah, fuck off. How's it going? Really good. I'm Pat. Nice to oh, meet you. This nice guy. to meet you. My name's Sarah, I'm not sure if you heard that already. Oh, you guys watch my other one, check it out. Uh, 13 Women versus Melbourne Chad, something like that. I think I called the video, and he was in it. And he, this guy tries to be super smooth, but he's not quite there yet. You know, he needs a bit more practice. No, we haven't met. We haven't met nah, ever. nah, your face looks a bit familiar, though. Yeah, see this guy. <laughs> yeah, no, I may have been somewhere on the internet. Well, I feel like attractive people always look a bit more familiar. And I think you're like cute, so. You know. Don't know. That's what it matters. It doesn't matter, he could have been um, a serial serial killer. But he looks good, so let's have a chat. But straight away, guys, she's into him because he looks good. And there's nothing wrong with that. It's just the nature of humans. But that other guy, he was too nice. The Jamie Foxx guy, he was too nice. You know, he's telling me he wants to teach her about IT if they hang out. Like, yeah, that's a real good pickup line. <laughs> yeah. I don't know if that's the same back, but... I... Uh, yeah. Oh, not as confident as the last guy. Yeah, he did all right. <laughs> he tried his best. Yeah. So what do you do? Uh, I model, I study, I work in logistics, a bit of everything. Logistics? What is that like? Oh. Sorry, I don't know. What's I, logistics? I drive, I drive trucks. You drive trucks? Yeah. And that's called logistics? Yeah. Well, aren't they just you're, called you're truck drivers? From, you're going from one place to another. Okay. All right, it sounds better. High, high intelligence. Uh, both of these people. I think mean, he seems half, half intelligent. I think he seems like a quite a smart guy, but she's an absolute ditz. But that's the thing, you know, you get this guy, he's like a really good looking dude. Um, 
trying to be super suave, whatever. But he's he's like top zero point one percent of guys. Like he looks good. He's got the very good you know genetic makeup, muscles and all that. Obviously, he works very hard in the gym. He has to sit here. It, like it's an audition with some chick who looks alright because she just slapped a bit of makeup on. Like she's a bit tubby, you know. I'm not saying she's fat, but she's a bit tubby. She's on a model. She's not looking as good as him. She's not the female equivalent of him. But he's got to sit there and, and answer all these stupid questions. And that's why I find the whole dating scene is almost like job interviews every time you go. It's very, very interesting the way that women treat it as logistics. Wait, can I be passenger princess in your truck? It's a pretty big truck. I don't know if you can handle it. You'll smash your back out, you know? I think I can. All right. Yeah. And then if you go to the store, you've got to get me, like, bring me back a couple of snacks when you get petrol. Ugh. Can that be like the... Yeah, always. Yeah. What's, your, what's your go-to snack then? Um, oh, are we talking chocolate, chips? What are we talking snacks about? Snacks these days. You go into one of those servos, you're paying like 20 bucks for a bottle of water. I ain't buying no jack shit. But this guy, he'll do it. All right. You go into like a candy store and you just look at a shelf. What are you taking off? Um, if it's candy, I love like anything sour. Like it's funny because I'm not actually a very sweet gal. I like like sour, like something like spicy almost, just something different. You know what I mean? But yeah. yeah. But if yeah, if you ask me, do I want anything from shops, and I say no, it's got to be like an unsaid agreement that you go bring me something back. Something yeah, there. you know, like if yeah. I get something. If I say no, that's just me being nice. If I get something, I really something, want something. Yeah, you're, you're, yeah, you're having a piece of. Oh, I get a bite. I always get a bite. Right. No, like, it's, best, like, it's like the, the Macca thing. Yeah, you know, yeah. like you always got to have the fries. You know? Yeah. Nah, 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 that's why I call bullshit on it. I used to get so pissed off with girlfriends that I'd had in the past. So say you went to McDonald's, right? Or you went to whatever. You went and bought some food together. You go, you go through the drive through and you say, hey, do you want something? I'm going to grab a cheeseburger meal, whatever it is. No, 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 I'm fine. You sure? Because this is my lunch. I'm hungry and I don't want to give you any of it. Yeah, 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 yeah. You go through the drive through The bag comes in. As soon as you get the bag, you get it to hold it while you're driving. They start eating your shit. You start eating all your chips. No, fuck off with that. Don't eat my food. That is, um, yeah, I'll get territorial over food. I don't like it. This is some cute thing. I know these chicks think it's cute to eat your food and want to play this game. Like he said, she was saying, oh, if you want to go inside the, the service station um, and I say, I don't want nothing. Well, bring me something anyway because I always want something, even if I say no and I'm trying to be nice. I don't know. As I said, women are mental cases. Patrick wants to go to space. Really? He's a space yeah. cadet. Like full... Full blown NASA or we'll just like a little day. imagination thing? <laughs> Sorry, that was so mean. <laughs> Righty, yeah. No, 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 no. It's really you're, you're cool. You're crushing my dreams, right? No, it's here. just because like obviously going to space is like a very like childhood dream thing. But are you like serious about it or it's just I'm like I'm gonna a make fun... it. I'm gonna make it. And you're oh, because you're doing physics, aren't you? I am. You're studying physics. That's actually like related because you can can you go into like space and. <laughs> Good on yeah, she's an absolute moron. She doesn't know what logistics is. You know, she's an only cans model who jams dildos up her ass for a living. So good on you, mate. You made a better choice than what you did in the last episode. Get her out of here. Oh. Hello. How you going? Nice to meet you. Oh. Nice to meet you. Your name? Adelia. Adelia. This is this is this is literally what happens on dating apps, right? You get yeah, you get this girl. She looks quite cute in a photo, and this fucking thing turns up. Jesus Christ! You waddles out. And you're like, fuck. I hope it's not her. Like you're sitting at the coffee shop, or you're waiting at the front of a coffee shop, and you see this chick walking up who sort of slightly resembles the girl who was sending your photos on the apps. She's walking up, and you're like, oh, I hope it's not her. And it's her. Like, fuck, and you're stuck there for a coffee. Oh, yeah. I'm Patrick. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. So you do physics? I do. So how long has that been going for? Uh, coming up on two or three years now. Okay. And do you want to do anything further than that? Like what career do you want to go into? I don't know. Oh! She's just going and done that on purpose, the big fatty. You know, she has no hope of that guy. She knew that she was going to get smashed. So she's sitting in the back there with the, um, the Jetto High Council saying, I'm going to hit that button no matter what, because she's never going to get picked. You know, he looks after himself. You know, she's 300 kilos and has the makeup of a transgender. So, I know I don't get this. I think it's a very stupid game, but it goes to show you how petty and stupid both women and, and men can be, you know. Hello. What's up? What's your What's name? Michael. <laughs> My name's Adelia. Adelia, hmm. where are you from? Uh, like suburb wise or? 
Oh, no, like, yeah, suburb, yeah, yeah nationality um, wise. Okay, so I'm the Norwegian Indian, in suburb, but oh, yeah. I'm on the west side of Melbourne. West oh, East. that's nice. Yeah, how so about what, you? Me? I'm from west side as well. And your nationality? Me? Try guess. Oh, I don't know. Nah, try guess. People never guess it though. I ain't gonna lie. North, south, mm, east, west. Can more you... east, like more middle. <laughs> try guess. I don't know. It ain't that high. Um, I'll give you a little hint. What a flog. Like, okay. it starts with C. Oh! I had it first. You, that was really violent. You hurt my hand. Oh, I'm sorry. I'll give you a hug for that. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to hurt your hand. It's okay. Hi. Oh, hey. Hi, how how are you, you doing? I'm good. What's your name? My name's Katrina. Have a seat. Have a seat. Be comfortable. How are you today? Be I'm great. How are you? I'm fantastic. How old are you? Oh, my God. Let's look around this up. Once again, a, a one out of ten. And you got this guy who's going to be all about it. The BBCs like the yellow. The yellow. They get the yellow fever, the big BBCs. <laughs> uh, this show makes you laugh. I'm 20. 20? Yeah. Damn, we're the same age. Yeah, we are. So where in Asia are you from? You want to guess my in this? <laughs> where in Asia? Mm, Vietnamese? Uh, all my parents are. Oh, yeah. I'm close, eh? You are. I'm not fully there, eh? Hey. No. So are you going to help me a little bit or? I am Australian, but I'm half. Oh, so you mix? <laughs> yeah, I am. Really? Yes. That's nice, baby. <laughs> <laughs> You're such a flirt. Am I? Yes. Can you handle it? Oh. Yes, okay. Can you handle what's down here? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. this is like Bumble Tinder 101, isn't it? <laughs> Can you handle it? Look at this guy, what a flog. This is a steve -o. This is African steve -o. Can you? Are, you? Are you sure about that? Are you big enough? I'm big, nigga. Really? Really? <laughs> I'm Congolese, nigga. <laughs> Got her an, an I got so not. Bye, baby. <laughs> That was me. Oh, I crossed the first. Yo, I just hate it. You are hate All right, halfway through with all this bullshit. All right. Guys, if you've enjoyed the content today, please sub to the channel. Aiming for 10K subs. Um, so really appreciate you guys joining the channel. And if you want to support the channel, let's watch my videos through to the end. And also, if you would like to contribute, check out my Patreon. But no stress. Let's go. Hate it. You are fucking hated. You are hated. What? Continue. Stay here. So, what do you do for a living? I study full time. I'm becoming a primary school teacher. Can I see your nails? Yeah, boy. Let me see your nails. My nails. I ain't gonna lie. Like, what's up? What's going on with your nails, B? What's going on with them? What do you mean? Your nails. What about them? And all that. What? You expect long nails? I expect nice nails. Wow, this guy's been watching a bit too much Fresh and Fit or, or something like that. This guy's pretty aggressive, really. Damn, you must be not a gentleman. I'm a gentleman. Really? But like... <laughs> yeah, that guy, I don't know about this guy, man. He, fucking, he probably shouldn't be on this show. He's out of hand. I don't give a fuck, bro. <laughs> Hello. Hi. How's it going? Oh, hi, this guy. I'm good trainer. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. How's your day been? Yeah, it's been good. How's yours? Not too bad. Not too bad. A bit different than the average day, yeah, but right. we're moving. What are your plans for tonight? Tonight? Oh, it's just a chill night. Chill I had night. work. Yeah. Five isn't hours it, Isn't it a Friday? Chill night? <laughs> for a Friday? Yeah. You don't go out on Fridays? I'm an introvert. What about you? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> This guy, this guy, oh, he's a classic. He's been on another one of my videos, just out of hand. These guys are just mental. <laughs> it was nice to meet you. It was nice to meet you too. Have a great day, right? Oh, I got a stand. Campbell. Thank you. My name oh, is Jenny. Yeah. You guys will love you this one. You've been up to today, taking it easy. Watching you reject all the girls. Yeah, sorry, it's a bit of a problem. I'm sorry is about that. that. Yeah. Okay, well, what, what's your type then? My type? Emo, goth, fashion motherfuckers. I don't think I fit that bill. No, wait. But who knows? Who's to say I don't exactly. like to try other things? Yeah. You know what I mean? Like, who knows? You gotta switch it maybe, up sometime. Maybe in another life. Maybe down the path. Hey, I'm, da I'm always down to try new things. I'm down for what you're down for. Yeah. What, mm -hmm. do, you, what do you do with yourself? Um, I'm a marketing and admin girly. What oh, do you okay. do? Uh, I work in content. Content? Retail, <laughs> university as well. What do you study? Uh, communications. 
so do I, starting working in comms. Oh yeah, nice. <laughs> I'm majoring in uh, journalism, social media, so yeah. So what do you, what do you, journalism. what's your focus going to be? I want to be a journal, I want to write, but... What do you want to write about? Sport. Okay. Yeah. Why do you want to write about sport? Because as write? a kid I've always been interested in sport, I love mm. sport. What it's sport? Awesome. Uh, boxing, fighting. Boxing, okay. Who's your favourite boxer? Favourite boxer, all time, probably Lomachenko. He's okay. Ukrainian, he's yep. pretty cool. Yeah. I you? don't know. We went over that. I oh, love marketing. <laughs> I, yeah, I love marketing. Oh, tell me about it. I, I want to hear it. You saw me earlier. Been... <laughs> Look at him, I just caught him just before he did it. I don't mind this guy, you know, he's got a good personality about him. Like, he's pretty confident. <laughs> I don't know with what's the style choices though, like... Yeah, I don't know what these mullets and, and dirty mo's and shit like that that these younger guys have these days. It's like, hey, give me the shittest haircut I can have. You walk to a barber and say, make me look like shit. Of <laughs> <laughs> all of them, I didn't want him. Hello. Hello. Campbell. Kim? Campbell. Campbell. Nice Brenda. to meet you. Nice to meet you as well. How's it going? Good, good. I like your little Hello Kitty belt. Thank you. It's my Pretty staple. Cute. Goes Pretty everywhere cute. with me. Mm. Mm. So. So. Let's start the conversation. Yeah, she's coming with smoke. She's trying to get me out of here real fast. No, I'm not. I'm just. Sure, you, I'm seem just a bit, like... you seem a bit on edge. They're all standing at the back, you know. They just want to get this guy out because he was on the last episode I covered of this. He was just smashing, was bang, 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 getting rid of all of them. Classic. You right? I'm, I'm fine. Oh, okay, I'm fine. I like the jewelry. It's very right, nice. Thank you. Seven, seven, seven. Yeah, it means luck. Luck. Mhm. Mm Do you think you're a lucky person? Um, no. That's why I wear it. Are oh, you trying to bring yourself more luck? Mhm. Candidates entitled to me. I do. She's coming across that way. I don't know. I just feel like entitlement. I don't know. It's a bit of like a, it's a bit of an evil trait. It's mm. kind of yeah. Mm. I don't know. I'm with yeah. you there, Camby. Good old Cambo. Um. You can tell these sort of girls, they come and sit here with nothing to offer um, a guy in any way, shape or form, but think they should be treated nicely and think that they are a real catch. Too much TikTok, uh, too much social media. Yeah. Mm. I'm not getting those vibes from you though. Okay, so that's if that good. makes you feel any better. I'm, I don't think I'm, you're, I don't yeah, think you're entitled. You. Okay. Yeah. What do you think my biggest turn off is? Oh, the biggest turn off. Straight away into that. Probably, I don't think you like cockiness. Yes. Thank okay. you. Well, there we go. I'm reading Hi. the room. There you go. Already, yeah, perfect. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> I like the look on his face when he does that. Smug I'm so sorry. Freak. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. No, not even a handshake. Cock oh. that. Get out of my face. <laughs> Get out of my face. Hi. Hello. How's it going? I'm good, how I love your nails. Oh, thank you. I do them myself. Yeah, they're awesome. Nice. Oh, so do you, are you like a beautician or something? I'm a nail tech, yeah. Oh, nice. You should do my nails. I often paint them. Let me I see them. Got... They're shitty. They're yeah. so Where do they get these people? Like, where do they get the girls and the guys? Are they from, like, Brunswick, Fitzroy, and you got all these, um, you know, other multicultural women? Oh, it's got to be out far west, like Melton, where it would be shit like that. Where's the inner? Where's the south? Where's, where's the south side of Melbourne represent? Where's the east? You know, it's like they, they get a slurry bus and just fill it up with slurries down in Werribee. Uh, yeah, now. Come, come to me, I'll get you good. Yeah. I'll get you Do you right. have like your own shop or something? Um, not yet. Um, it's in my house, but I've like set up my garage all cute, all nice and whatever. Yeah, nice. Yeah. How long have you been doing that for? Um, since the start of this year, so like oh, okay. nine months now. Oh, are you liking it? Yeah. Enjoying it? Yeah, it's actually really fun. Like, I enjoy doing people's nails. Mm. And sometimes I'll just be doing nails at 1am. Mm. Oh, nice. Is there anything else you're into? What are your other hobbies? Um, you I like to it. run. Run? Yeah, I'm an athlete. Oh, what distance? Um, I do like the sprints. 100 oh, nice. meters, 200, 400, yeah. What I've ran you? a couple half marathons in my time. See, I wouldn't want to do the marathon. Yeah. Because that's long. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, no, I used to, like you run every day or you train every day? I train like four times a week. Oh, nice. Yeah, yeah that's like the to. same. I'm boxing, so I train like four times a week as well. Oh, okay. Monday okay. through Thursday. I used to do boxing as like a hobby because I didn't like going to the gym, so I would like go to this boxing. Do you gym. reckon you could beat me up? <laughs> <laughs> you reckon you could beat me up? Yeah. Go on. Yeah. It's, like, it's like emo Justin Bieber. What is this guy? Justin Bieber with a mullet. Hold well on. <laughs> <laughs> Well done. Uh, well. <laughs> hey. All right. Hi, we got, we got one what's your name? here, guys. Mass. Mass. Yes, what's your name? I got that before. Yeah, right. You did. All right. And then you did this. <laughs> what's your name? Lucky. Lucky. Yeah. Do you feel lucky? 
I do. No. I like this guy. I like him. Sometimes Jamie it really Fox. depends on what I'm what I'm up to. What sort of phase is, phase of life are you High are, are you going through right now? I'm in the phase where I'm just trying to figure out who I am. Right. How yeah. old are you? I'm twenty. Twenty. Yeah, how old are you? Twenty one. Oh, okay, that's not bad. Do I look older? No, you look like around that age, you're like 20, 30. 23. Yeah, because most people think I'm like 25. Oh, you, look you don't even look 25. I don't. No, you don't. Yeah, that's cool. I like your chain. Is it the beads? Thank you. I have the waist He's had no horny and shit. He's like, huh? yeah. I said, you work out? Ooh, Sometimes. Yeah, yeah. Why do I look like I work out? I mean. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> do I make you nervous? A little bit. Yeah. Okay, I mean, you'll make me nervous, to be honest. I do. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, you're cute, so. I'm cute? Mm -hmm. All right. Are you from around here? Like, where about you from? I live in West Side. West Side. Yeah. Right. Where do you live? Is that the ghetto? That's not the <laughs> ghetto. That's like East Side. Like, Danny Long is the ghetto. No, it's no, not. the Southeast. All it is. Yeah, so right. Southeast is ghetto. It's the ghetto, ghetto. But, like, I live in. I mean, they would call it the ghetto in West Side because I live in Melton. Oh, right. Melton. Yeah, but there I live in, like, the new side where it's, like, good <laughs> and nobody is getting shot. Just, like, five minutes off from Melton. Hey, 10, actually. No. Okay. Oh, oh, look at that swim bang. <laughs> you didn't Fuck press it. <laughs> anyway, that's the show, guys. Another load of bullshit that I've brought to you today. I just thought it was something different. We mix it up. We have a bit of fun in some of the videos. I talk about more serious things in others. So, guys, if you've enjoyed it and you haven't sub, please sub. Try to get to 10K. All right, guys, thank you very much if you've watched this far. I'll see you in the next one.